What's going on? This is Mark Henry, the world's strongest man. I'm out here in Houston at Corey Redding's 10th annual Desire, Discipline, and Dedication Camp, 3D camp, if you will. You got kids, as you can see, as far as the eye can see, all trying to learn fundamentals and have people support them. So that's what I'm out here for. We're going to have a good time. Desire, discipline, dedication. For 10 years, Corey Redding has been preaching these ethics to the youth of the greater Houston area and across the country. From humble beginnings, Redding's desire to make change in his hometown started with only a dozen campers. Hello, my name is Corey Redding, and this is the 10th annual 3D football camp. 3D stands for desire, dedication, and discipline. And I believe those are the three core values that everyone needs to be successful in life. They have the desire to be great in life. They have the discipline to, you know, stay home and get extra homework, go to tutoring, you know, uh, doing the best that they can be in their sport and in school. And if they have the dedication behind it, I believe those three core values will help them be so successful in the business world, in the communities in which they live, and uh, make them, the kids, become great men and women, um, serving their communities and wherever they live. Football was the hook. The main message, desire, discipline, and dedication, making the right decisions. Redding's goal, get the message to as many of our kids as possible. My grade is I'm kinder and I'm really glad to be here because my coach is really fun and I like these stations. There it is. Talked about fundamentals of football, but not just football. They've talked to the kids about hard work and giving back to the community follow through and just being dedicated, striving to reach your dreams that nothing is impossible. So the kids are having a blast. They learned a lot of things about football, technique, how to get better. And they've also, um, you know, they get to interact with the football players. We love it. We'll definitely be back next year. And I think it's awesome what they're doing here for the kids in the community. Rallying the community was the key. With the help of a growing list of NFL and former Longhorn teammates, Galena Park ISD, North Shore Mustang coaches, over 40 volunteers, a growing list of sponsors, invested parents and guardians, and especially through Redding's dedication, the camp has now sold out four years in a row. Hosting over 200 local youth annually, Redding and Friends has grown over the past 10 years, but continued community support will be key to reaching our hopeful leaders of tomorrow. Hello, my name is Stefan Morris. I go to Fur High School. I've been here for eight years. Like it helps build up endurance, speed, strength, footwork, and a lot. And it's just really great to be here. They still sleeping there, thinking about what level they're gonna beat today on some kind of game, or you know what park they're gonna go to, and all this stuff. But you guys. Y'all say y'all want to do something more, so thank you for coming out this morning. Camp is perfect for this community. There's a lot of kids who don't have fathers here. There's a lot of kids who are um, looking for something to do in the summer to get the skills that they need for football. So for this camp to come out to this community every year and offer that to the youth is just great. It's phenomenal. Here at the Corey Redding Camp, the kids got here about 7 o'clock this morning. There are a bunch of awesome coaches here that are working with the kids, keep teaching them fundamentals and techniques. They're really making it fun for the kids while they're learning. They've been here working hard. The kids are enjoying it. We don't even mind how hot it is. We're staying really hydrated and having a blast. And I just appreciate all the hard work and dedication that goes into putting something like this together. It's so beneficial to the kids. And as a parent, I just really appreciate having the opportunity for my kids to be involved.
first year we started the football camp, we had about 12 kids. And we still ran those kids like we had 300. I mean, it was, it was, it was a blast. It was a great way to start, but we wasn't, we wasn't satisfied. You know, 3D camp has spread across the state, spread across the country. We have kids driving in from Louisiana, kids flying in from California. We have kids here now that's in the camp and it's been here three or four years in a row. Now we have over 200 kids every year. We've been sold out the last four years. And so that's truly a blessing to have this. The growth is unbelievable. And these kids are walking away with better football skills, but at the end of the day, seeds that's poured on their hearts is gonna make them better men and women in whatever communities they live in.